Fuck all these niggas and bitches, they dead to me. I got the sauce, I got the remedy. Say my thought, but act like an enemy. I make a call and turn you to cannon. Not wasting my time, not wasting my energy. Shot for my confidence, shot for a better me. A little bit undercut as well on his follow attempt. Green turns a corner, blows by him, goes to the rim and throws it up and in. Plus the foul. Somebody got to show these Wizards how to play this game. Open. Turn it all the way down low and just let it simmer overnight. Mr. Jalen Green. Mr. Jalen Green. Ooh. What is motivating you? Um, my family. My family. Um, my baby. So, yeah. You're the best, Jalen. Thank you. Thank you. Since All-Star break. Dre, I'm going to say this. You're a lovely woman. We know we know what you ha have you done in this industry. Um, You need to be patched. Because what I'm seeing in the last six games from Jalen Green, since the news came out about him having a baby with you, the man is putting the league unnoticed. Tonight, he dropped 42 points. Yes, versus the probably, arguably, the worst team in the league. Okay. With 10 rebounds. But, this man has been balling the last six games. With the Houston Rockets being on a six-game winning streak, without Alfred Sengun, Looking like the next Nikola Jokic out there. So, in today's video, we're going to be talking about Dre Michelle got Jalen Green acting, playing like a demon possessed. <laughs> What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Will. We're back again with another video. Now, if y'all enjoy NBA commentary, y'all love NBA content, love watching the NBA, love NBA analysis, Give your boy a like, subscribe to channel if you're new. I'm dropping every week for y'all. I'm going to be dropping even more consistently for y'all. And I appreciate y'all for support. The Houston Rockets are on a six-game win streak. As y'all can see in the last couple of clips, Jalen Green has been going, has been little, finally playing up to his potential. Because starting the season, I expected Jalen Green to have a breakout year. He's been very inconsistent this year. But since the news came out with him being with Jeremy Michelle and him impregnating her, he is finally revealing his bag that I already thought he already had. You see the handle. You see the step back. You see the confidence in his shot. You see the layup package. You see the athleticism. You see all those things. Who, who you can compare that to in the lead right now? You can compare that to Anthony Edwards. You can compare that to John Morant. You can compare that to Zion Williamson. You can compare it to all these other players that's hoping in the league right now. Jalen Green is just as talented. It's just he's inconsistent. I, I, and I think it's confidence-wise. Since the news came out and since y'all seen the clips, what's motivating him right now is his baby. This man has been hooping. And he's not being talked about enough because... Yes, the opponents he's going up against, yes, the Washington Wizards are garbage. But he did play the Cleveland Cavaliers, too, and he was hooping against them, too. This man already can score with the best of them. If he continues to add more to his playmaking bag, he's already getting, he's already crashing the, gra crashing the glass pretty good also. He had 10 rebounds. If he can improve his defense, man, watch Houston, we have a problem. Next year, y'all going to be scary good. Scary good. Because Alfred Shagoon, they probably going to sit him out for the rest of the year. Y'all not going to make the playoffs this year, right? This is a growing year. This is a, a positive year for y'all. With, with Cam Whitmore improving. With I'm in Thompson improvement. 
with Jabari Smith finally coming to his own also. And you still have that veteran leadership with Fred Van Vliet on the team. Houston, this is this is gonna be big for y'all, man. This and obviously one of the best coaches in the league who was just mentoring Jelly Green. And just getting him his, getting in his head, like, look, just remember, you are that dude. You have the bag. You have the potential. You have the scoring ability. You have the ability. The potential to be probably the best scorer in the league if you continue to play like this. He just needed a little motivation. And from one of the best in the game, Dre Michelle. I know he's thanking, thanking her so much because now, just wait till next season. This season, he he's, he's finally... Like, look, I'm going to give y'all a glimpse who, who I can really be next year. Jalen Green is going to be just as good as those guys that's going to be the face of the league. He's going to be probably the, the most dominant scorer in the game. Coming soon, y'all. He's finally living it up. Y'all seen the bag he has. He can shoot with the best of them. He got the athleticism out of this world with the best of them. He got the handle. He has the passing ability. Get his playmaking better a little bit. Man. Y'all. Jalen Green is coming. And congrats to him and Dre Michelle. You know, wishing them the best. And just keep doing your thing, man. Just keep improving. Because y'all going to be scary good next year. And that's all I got to say for this video. If y'all enjoyed, give your ball a like, subscribe, to if you're new. Comment down below. Is Dre and Michelle the reason why Jalen Green is playing like this? Or is this really he finally found his confidence because of her? Or vice versa? I appreciate y'all too for this video. It's been your boy, Will. And I'm